carved wood bear. Let me show you how I do this. I took a top and side view of a bear, printed it out, and stuck it on this piece of pine wood. I aligned the two templates so that the nose, eyes, ears matched on both the top and side. I went over to the scroll saw and cut the side profile first, making sure to leave the top profile intact. I retaped the piece together and then cut the top shape out. Now we have a three-dimensional cutout that we can begin to refine and shape into our bear. We have four legs, but they are all connected. I'll draw a few lines so we can carve out each limb into its own separate extremity. Now using the Dremel tool will work on the legs. I'm using a high speed cutter bit. There's lots of different bits for use with the Dremel and it's a very diverse tool. I'll leave a link in the video description if you want to learn a little bit more about what I'm using. Now we'll use the sanding drum bits to shape and round over our piece and start to get that look, you know, a little bit more organic and natural. We'll work under the belly and legs as well as all around the torso. Let's switch off the sanding drum for a high speed cutter. We want this to reach the tighter spots that the sander could not, as well as remove some bulk from those harder to reach areas. Now let's switch back to the sanding drum and dig in and shape deeper. At this point I'm using a round diamond bit to smooth out high spots wherever it's needed. These bits are really good for shaping and are less aggressive than the high speed bits. If you're easy with them, they can help smooth out difficult areas. Finally, we'll do some hand sanding and finish this up. Check out the final piece. Came out really nice, I think. Subscribe to follow what I make. I do a lot of different things, so here on this channel you'll see woodworking, crafts, vlogs, and even music that I record. I'll catch you guys next time.